cannot believe that I'm having my chipolata filmed. There we go. Uh, I'll tell you why, because we, we've got Mark Taylor with us this morning. Mark is Managing Director of Hot Can. They have produced a Christmas dinner in a can. Uh, if you were listening a little while ago, uh, we pulled the can, and that started this whole heating process within it. And eight to ten minutes later, lo and behold, Mark, we have our Christmas dinner. Uh, now, alongside uh, Mark, we've got our next guest, who we're going to sort of drag in as a bit of a guinea pig as well. Uh, this is uh, Carl. Morning to you, Carl. Morning. Morning. We'll explain why Carl's with us in a couple of moments' time. Uh, are you hungry at this time of day? Um, yeah, Christmas dinner's not really my <laughs> ideal breakfast, but... Uh, <laughs> yeah, we'll it should really it be porridge, shouldn't it? So, I've got... Oh, I'm, I'm really doing really, really well here. I've managed to get a chipolata from the, uh, from the tin. OK, can I just say, I'm a sucker for those beans and little sausages, so I'm probably going to like this. Uh, Mmm, well, that's actually really good. That's probably better than I could produce on a Christmas day, for uh, truth be known. It's, I, I think it's good. I like it. OK, I mean, Carl, don't be shy. Tuck in. I've, I've just tried some. It's very, very nice. You don't want another mouthful? <laughs> <laughs> Go on, fill your boots. Um, I've got a nice bit of um, carrot there. And a little bit of turkey. Mm. It is very much like um, a turkey casserole, isn't it? In effect, it is. Yeah. Mm. It just has everything in that you would traditionally have in a Christmas dinner. I hate the way that it's warm as well. I mean, who would have thought that you could do that just by piercing a can three times? That's right, and of course it, you can have it anywhere, whether you're on the top of a mountain, on a building site, on wherever you are. 